Hello and welcome back to the Masters of Engineering. In this video, you will learn that how to derive the ordinates of a unit hydrograph of different duration from a given unit hydrograph's ordinate using superposition method. Okay, I have been given a question which states that given below are the ordinates of a four hour unit hydrograph as below. And we have to derive the ordinates of a 12 hour unit hydrograph for the same catchment using the superposition method. Okay. The first uh, row is showing the time in hours and second uh, row is showing the ordinate of a four hour unit hydrograph in meter cube per second. Okay. So at time zero ordinate is zero at time four hour ordinate is 20 and so on for the rest of the uh, time uh, uh, for the rest of the time. Okay. To, to solve this question, first we will draw a, a table, okay, having a six column. The first one is the time in hours. Second uh, is the ordinate of the four hour unit hydrograph. First, ordinates are uh, same, which is given in the question, okay. Uh, they start from time zero. Second column, uh, we will write the same ordinate, but they will be lagged by four hour, okay. And for the third column, we will again write the same ordinates of the given four hour unit hydrograph, but we will lag them by eight hours. Okay. And after that, uh, we will add these three columns that is ordinates of a uh, given unit hydrograph, ordinates lagged by four hour and ordinate lagged by eight hour. Okay. And finally, when you divide these uh, ordinates, uh, which you get a direct run of hydrograph of three centimeter okay for a duration of 12 hour when you divide the ordinates of a direct run of hydrograph by the effective rainfall which in this case will be three centimeter you will get the ordinates of 12 hour unit hydrograph okay so let's solve the question uh, first we will select uh, these ordinates of the given unit hydrograph and lag them by four hour okay so uh, we will paste them here Okay, so at time four hour ordinate when uh, they will be lagged by four hour is zero ordinate of four hour unit hydrograph is zero at uh, time of eight hour ordinate is 20 at time of 12 hour ordinate is 80 and so on for the rest of the values. Okay, similarly in the fourth column you will write the same ordinates but lagged by eight hours. Okay, so again you will uh, select these okay and you will paste them here select uh, first these ordinates and then write them at here at eight hours press ctrl v okay so for time of eight hours ordinate of four hour unit hydrograph is zero for time of 12 hours ordinate is 20 and so on for the rest of the time values okay after that you will add these three column that is column two plus column three plus column four and this will give you the direct run of hydrograph of three centimeter for 12 hour duration okay so you will add these three column that is first you will write equal sign then column second plus column third okay plus column four here uh, column third and four is zero so you will only uh, select column first okay after that for the second time you will again write equal and add uh, the three columns so that is 20 plus zero plus zero okay and uh, for a time of eight hours add these three that is 80 plus 20 plus zero okay after that you can uh, drag it till the last row and excel will automatically calculate for you the values okay so this direct run of hydrograph of three centimeter for a duration of 12 hour it will be the sum of ordinates of four hour unit hydrograph ordinates lagged by four hour and ordinates lagged by 
8 are okay and you know that to get the ordinates of the unit hydrograph you simply divide the ordinates of the direct runoff hydrograph by effective rainfall here the effective rainfall will be 3 centimeter okay that is 1 centimeter for the given uh, unit hydrograph 1 centimeter for uh, unit hydrograph lagged by 4 hour and 1 centimeter for unit hydrograph lagged by 8 hours so total will be 3 centimeter of effective rainfall and when you divide the direct runoff hydrograph by the effective rainfall which is 3 you will get the ordinates of a, a unit hydrograph for a duration of 12 hour okay so write equal sign then select the ordinate of direct runoff hydrograph uh, of uh, 3 centimeter divided by the effective rainfall which here is 3 centimeter you will get the ordinate of a 12 hour uh, hydrograph 12 hour unit hydrograph okay and then you will select the first row and drag it till the last row and excel will automatically calculate for you the values okay one second okay so excel will automatically calculate for you the values i think here the values are rounded off so increase the decimal place this will give you the actual ordinates okay so ordinate of unit hydrograph at uh, a four hour is uh, 6.67 okay uh, at eight hours it's 33.33 .33 at 12 hours it's 76.6 and simply you have to divide the ordinate of a direct runoff hydrograph which you obtain by superposition method by the effective rainfall and you will get the ordinate of a uh, 12 hour unit hydrograph okay uh, so this is how you can uh, obtain the ordinates uh, of a unit hydrograph of a different duration from the ordinates of a, a unit hydrograph of a given duration using the superposition method okay so uh, this uh, method is valid only when you have to find the ordinates of a unit hydrograph of different duration which is a multiple of the uh, given unit hydrograph okay here it was a multiple of three okay that is uh, for given was four hour and we have to find uh, the ordinate for a 12 hour okay so this method is valid only uh, when we have to find ordinates of different duration which is a multiple of uh, the given duration okay uh, so this is how you can calculate uh, the ordinates of a unit hydrograph of different duration using the superposition method i hope this solution video was clear and effective and you definitely learn something new if you still have doubts you can uh, write them in the comment box okay i will try my best to answer your doubts and if you found this video helpful you can like this video subscribe to my channel and share this video thanks for watching master civil engineering and uh, stay tuned